Hey, what's up? Jigzor here. Do you need to back up and restore your WhatsApp messages? I recently had to do this myself and found a method that works very well. In this video, I will show you how to quickly back up and restore WhatsApp chats on your iPhone. Let's go. If you ask me, the best approach to back up and restore WhatsApp is to keep it simple with a single dedicated software. I've tested all the popular recovery tools, and honestly, this is the only one that works effectively. With this software, you can back up and restore your data without restrictions, especially when it comes to storage. This comes in handy when you're short on device space or iCloud storage. It comes with a free trial so you can see what's recoverable before committing to the full version. And if you do decide to go for it, I have copied the link in the description box below with a special discount just for you. Once you have the software installed, navigate to the Backup and Restore menu and choose WhatsApp from the list of supported apps. Now, click the Backup button and connect your iPhone to your computer using an original or an MFI certified cable to establish a successful connection for data transfer. If your iPhone asks you to trust this computer, go ahead and follow the on-screen prompts. From there, just let the software do its thing. It'll scan your device for WhatsApp data, so be patient, especially if you have a lot of messages. And don't disconnect your phone to avoid interrupting the backup process. When the backup is complete, you can preview your WhatsApp chats, including any attachments, and pick exactly what you want to restore. Now, if you're restoring a backup to your iPhone, just select WhatsApp Messages. Click Recover to Device. And let the software take care of the rest. Keep in mind that messages can be restored directly to your phone, but attachments can only be saved to your computer. Once it's done, open WhatsApp, and everything should be restored effortlessly. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions about the video or want me to create a tutorial about another topic, leave a comment below. See you next time. Bye.